back with another video of CVS game. And y'all already know this is about to be about when I had my first and second season. I'm gonna talk about my first one, and I'm gonna talk about and I'm gonna talk about my second one too, because my second one was crazy. So my first one and my second one was crazy. So had to take a drink before I start talking about this. Okay, my first one happened, like it was my first one, so I really didn't know what was going on. So my first one happened, it happened early in the morning, like very early in the morning, and I was asleep. I was not up, I was asleep, and I guess I had it in my seat, and I woke up in the back of her. I woke in the I woke up in the back of the paramedics on the way to the hospital in the bright light and I guess the um paramedic the paramedic people put that thing on me to wake me up and that bright light was in my face and I was like I was nervous, I was like and I was like I didn't know where I was at. I thought somebody kidnapped me and stuff. I was like, Mama, Mama I would call my mom and my mama was like, um, calm down, you have Caesar and I was like Okay, I was just happy to hear my mama voice because I didn't, I didn't know what was going on, and I didn't know about a seizure either. I was, I was just know I was on the back of, on my way to the hospital, and it was crazy because I didn't, I really didn't know what was going on. And when I got to the hospital, I wake up in the hospital. I guess I fall asleep when I was on my way to the hospital too. I went back to sleep, and when I woke up, I was in the hospital, and I saw I had to get up and walk in the hospital, but I guess I was still dizzy, like, it seemed like I was about to fall back down, so I got back in the bed, I was like, no, I can't do this, so I was in the bed for like a whole nother hour, I was, like, I was in the hospital for like three hours that day, and then I went home, and then my second season, that when I spent the night over my sister's house and I had a second one when I was at my sister's house and that was early in the morning too and my sister heard a loud noise cause you know when you have a season you fall off your bed and stuff and you start jumping back and my sister thought I was dead because I stopped breathing and stuff I wasn't, my sister I was not breathing at all and my sister thought I was dead she called my mama, so my mama was out there. My mama said, call the paramedics, and the paramedics got there. Like, my sister woke everybody up in the house that how, that how bad it was. Like, my sister thought I was dead. So, I talk about the second one. My sister thought I was dead, and I was asleep on that one too. But I woke up, I woke up when the paramedics got inside my sister's house and put me on the bed and stuff. And I heard the fingers, they were talking about how many fingers I got up, I told them that. And then, um, they rushed me to the hospital, I didn't know what was going on. They rushed me to the hospital that day. So, and then, I had more than two seizures, but the rest, my mama know what the, my mama know how to stop it then. I didn't have to go to the hospital no more because my mama know how to stop it. Now, most of the time I do have seizures now, my mama know how to like put my hands behind my back, hold my head up, hold my head back, so, so she know how to stop it now. But it's been months since I had one. So thank God for that. I didn't have one a long time, so I'm doing good now. But um, yeah, you can have some drink, y'all. And most of the time, my mama hate when I go when I do spend the night over my friend's house. My mama hate that because she be thinking something might happen. She be thinking I might have another season or something. So most of the time I couldn't spend the night nowhere because my family was thinking something. 
happened or something. And most of the time, I just asked my sister, can I spend that over her house? She was like, no, 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 you got to stay home with mama. Because she, my sister get real nervous. Like, she really thought she lost me that day. Whew. But now I'm good. I've been spending night over people houses and stuff. I haven't. I have not had a seizure in months. So I thank God for that. I've been good. Y'all know most people who do have seizures that don't make it in life. So I thank God for still keeping me here on this day, because most people who do have seizures don't not make it. Do not make it. So I do thank God for keeping me here, giving me another chance, getting my life together and stuff. But I've been doing good. I don't know how I had a season at first, but I heard people do have seasons different. Like it can be anything. You can you can have a season about drinking and stuff. I heard if you smush yourself in your seat, you can have a season. Like anything can happen by having a season. So, and tell you the truth, it was a hard life for me. I couldn't really go nowhere because people think I was, it was happening. So, people who are out there right now have a season, keep your head up. Because I know there's a God who fits it and make everything okay. So I really don't got much to say no more. But that was story time. Whew. So make sure I like this video. Comment down below. If you're new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Turn the notification bell. And I will be back with more videos. I do got a video, I do got another video coming that I didn't do a video, but I do want to do a video. I want to paint my walls, so that might be a video. So I do got another video coming, but don't forget to like this video. Okay, okay. Gang, gang, gang.